If you're like me and believe more in multi-purpose devices rather than a single purpose device, then a convection microwave oven is ideal for you. To identify the best convection microwave oven for you, I went over 18 different types of convection microwave ovens of different sizes and different brands that you can see on the screen right now. There are a few key parameters that you have to look at before you make the decision to purchase a convection microwave oven. The first is what is the capacity that you require. Now, if you are a smaller family of one to three people, a convection microwave oven of less than 25 liters might be sufficient for you. In most cases, for a nuclear family, a convection microwave oven between 26 and 30 liters would be ideal and sufficient for your use case. There are convection microwave ovens over 30 liters, but those would be ideal for really large families of, or if you use the microwave for hosting quite a bit as well. The next is the wattage of the convection microwave oven. Now the wattage determines how quickly your food can be cooked or baked. Now in general the manufacturer will provide two types of wattages. One is the input wattage and second is the output wattage. You need to consider the output wattage which is generally between 700, 800 and 900 watts. Now as you can see on the screen, most of the ones that are above 26 liters are 900 watts and everything below that is 800 watts. The next thing to consider is what is the material used in the inside cavity of the convection microwave oven. There are two options, one is stainless steel and the other is ceramic. In general, Samsung is the only one who has continued to use ceramic. Most of the other manufacturers are moving towards stainless steel. Now, stainless steel is expected to be more energy efficient because stainless steel heats up a lot faster than ceramic. But it is a little bit more difficult to clean and there have been some reports of the stainless steel cavity getting rusted. Compared to that, in the case of ceramic, the energy efficiency is not as good as stainless steel cavities, but it is expected to be easier to clean as well as slightly longer lasting as well. So based on what your preference is, you might want to consider that before purchasing. Now let's come to the main parts of what all capabilities can a convection microwave oven perform. All of the convection microwave ovens do the basic tasks of heating, defrosting, cooking, baking, grilling. They also claim to do toasting, but it may not be as good as toasting that is done in an OTG. The main difference comes in a few key settings that you might want in a convection microwave oven. The first is a rotisserie. A rotisserie is nothing but a turn grill. So you can actually create grilled chicken, grilled vegetables. You can actually mount them on top of a skewer and the skewer rotates, thereby grilling the chicken or the vegetables in a consistent manner. Now, not all models have this. None of the small size models have this. The IFB, Panasonic, as well as the LG charcoal models. Now, low fry, oil free, slim fry, or diet fry, as some of the manufacturers like to call it, in general is available in all of the models. But some of the convection microwave ovens have this setting out of the box in the convection microwave oven itself. You can still do the same dishes if you know what temperature and time you need to cook the dishes, but it is a good setting to have if you want something out of the box. The next important setting is making curd or fermentation. You don't need an out of the box setting for it. If you know again what the temperature and the time that you need to set, you can do it without an out of the box setting. But with an out of the box setting, it just becomes a lot easier. All of the models have a child lock capability. There's really no differentiation in that. Some models have an auto clean like you can see on the screen. In my opinion, you can simulate auto clean with just heating water and lemon for about three minutes and wiping it down. It kind of gives you the same effect of the auto clean that most of these vendors come out with as an out of the box setting. There is also a concept of starter kit, which a lot of these manufacturers provide. Now, this is nothing but giving you additional vessels that you can use in the convection microwave oven. In general, these are plastic, which I do not prefer. So I don't really call this a differentiator again. From a reviews point of view, like always, I have selected the best convection microwave oven so I can identify the best of the best for your purchase. From a warranty point of view, almost all of these vendors offer a one year warranty on the product, except for Morphe Richards, which offers a two years warranty on the product. In addition to that, some vendors also offer an additional warranty on the Magnetron, 
which can be crucial because that is like the core part of the convection microwave oven. So IFB, Samsung and LG do give an additional warranty on the Magnetron as well. In addition, Samsung also gives a warranty on the cavity as well, which can be useful because Sometimes the cavity can get cracked because of excessive heat in the case of ceramic cavities and in the case of stainless steel cavities, it can get rusted. So based on all of these parameters, what are my recommendations? So firstly, I would highly recommend pretty much families of all sizes to go between a 26 to 30 liter only because one, the price difference between the lower size and these sizes is not significantly high. These sizes do give you a little bit more additional capabilities. So with that in mind, my first recommendation is the Samsung 28 liter model. This is the exact same model that I use as well. I have been using this particular model for last two years. Previously, I had an earlier version of the same model as well, which I used for about 10 plus years. The reason why I recommend this model is that it's got a great set of capabilities. The only thing that it's missing is the rotisserie as well as the auto clean capability. But the biggest benefit is that it offers an additional warranty of five years on the Magnetron and another 10 years warranty on the cavity itself, which is not offered by any of the other models. My second recommendation is the LG Charcoal 28 liters. Now, if you're looking for a fully loaded convection microwave oven, then this is the model for you. It's got all of the capabilities like auto clean, rotisserie, uh, making curd, fermentation, and so on, everything that we spoke about earlier. In addition, it, it gives a one year warranty on the product and four years warranty on the Magnetron. Again, a differentiator, which not all of the vendors do provide. There is no warranty on the cavity and this particular model does use a stainless steel cavity. For the larger size, that is the 30 plus liters, I recommend again an LG model. For the smaller size, less than 25 liters, I would recommend the IFB 23 liters or the LG 21 liters. Now these two models do give a little bit more capability than everything else in the form of auto clean or slim fry and also an additional warranty on the Magnetron itself. But in general, I don't recommend a model that is less than 25 liters for the reasons I mentioned earlier. I hope this was useful. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.